Okay, we're going to read the instructions now. See what it says. Uh, fast mounting. No. There shouldn't be a big lot of difference. There's the tools you need right there. Screwdriver. I don't know what screwdriver's for. Anyway. Troubleshooting. Hmm. If you get cold water from your hot water, then you got it looked up wrong. Probably got it looked up wrong. I guess that's what I'll do. Okay, so that's done. I'll oh, take it all apart. Be ready. I'm ready to put some caulking from compound around. And the soap dispenser. Utility knife preparation. Spread on. Fonchon. Fonchon. Yep. Okay, I'm going to. Uh, I got the old fastest take out. I'm going to uh, install a new set. Uh, the other ones gave up the ghost, so I got a new set now, peerless. And uh, pull out tight. So we're going to. Check to see that, well, 8 inches, that everything is going to line up pretty good, yeah. I see one little, one little spot right there, you might be able to see where the, the other uh, faceplate was down there. So we got that little, you notice that there, so. Anyway, we're going to, this is the tools, you're going to need some of them. And we got to get under the sink, which is another tight spot. So the valves are off. You'll need a light and the faucets. So. And that's the faucets in that right there. So we get that ready first. Oops. Okay, take the pull out sprayer out of the machine. And set those things on. It looks like there's a lip on the back that might not fit right. I got my doubts if that's going to fit right, to tell you the truth. And install that in there. Oh, yeah. She fits. Okay. So we're on there. Now we got to go below and put the nuts on. The nut and this piece right here. This so next thing that goes on. This goes there, number 15, 18, and 17. Okay, I got that put on. I changed it all around. I'm going to put the wall. Put the uh, dispenser over on the right hand side. I think it'd be a little better. So, anyway, I'm not going to use any caulking or anything. You'll see the mark right here. See that where the old one was? Anyway, now I got the faucets on, and those little pieces, tubing right there, flex tubing, is too short. So, I'm going to have to get some uh, some more and uh, new ones. I don't know why they don't make it uh, all the same length when they make faucets. I guess they cut back on the on the copper. Cheaper, a bit cheaper to make. Anyway, out. So we get new two new supply tubes. Oop. Okay, I gotta take these supply tubes off now. So, a bit of water running down there. But there's nothing. Anyway, I'm gonna get two new ones of those. 
cuts are too short now. There's one off, and the other one is over here. Anyway, it's the same as the other one, so. I got the hot water one connected anyway. I pulled a. There was enough slack in the in the half inch copper line and the valve and that there that I could pull it up a bit and it reached the uh, the copper pipe coming down from the uh, faucet so that one's okay so I'll turn that one on we'll have hot water anyway that's all he wants for now Out. okay I got that supply tube on too now two supply tubes is on and tight Hopefully there's no leaks. Now I gotta put this other one that comes down from both of the sprayer. Gotta go on. Now I had to put a shim in up there and I got the two uh so I gotta just turn on the valves now. See how many leaks I got? And I don't see anything leaking. There's a little man, there's Don't seem like much pressure. Now all I gotta do now is put on this, this thing here. This might be the last thing. Sure, it goes on the top. And that goes down through there, <clears throat> and this goes on the bottom. Okay, that's done. That's on. Now, put this down through. Right now, there's a nozzle. I guess the same old, the same size. I wonder if it fits on there, imagine. The bottle goes under. Thank <laughs> you. 